To legal matters now, the Federal High Court sitting in Lagos was today faced with a conflict in the case of the chairman of Capital Oil and Gas Limited, Ifan Yoba. Justice Mohammed Idris had ordered the Department of State Services and its Director General to produce Mr. Oba in court today or show cause why he should not be produced. But rather than produce him in court, the counsel to the DSS told Justice Idris that the agency had obtained an order in Abuja to keep Mr. Uba for another 14 days. The DSS is keeping Mr. Uba in custody on account of allegations of economic sabotage and diversion of petroleum products to the tune of 11 billion naira. His lawyer, Prince Ajibola Uluyedi, asked Justice Idris to order his immediate release. We are certainly not pleased that our client continues to remain in incarceration by DSS unjustifiably because he has done nothing criminal. According to the claim of the DSS, he has released some uh, product into the market which according to them belong to the NNPC. Now this product even if it is true that he that released this into the market. And he released it into the market to save the nation from a, a crisis of shortage. Now they claim that product is worth 11 billion uh, naira. Now they themselves admit that they are owing him 16 billion, 14 to 16 billion naira. But they say, I don't know what kind of business sense that is, that he must pay them first. He must pay their own 11 billion first before they will consider paying his own 16 billion and it's for that reason that they got the dss because they're a government parastatal to arrest and to detain him and to paint him like a criminal when they know that he has done nothing wrong